success story session. Today we have a moment with us and I, I still remember the first interaction which I had with Momen. Uh, a guy walks into my cabin and says that, do you know what, uh, I come from Indoor, right, which is a tier two place. But uh, at that point of time, he told that, <clears throat> do you know what, Barani, I would 100% get a job in data science. I'm not sure whether you remember that or not, Momen, but I, I remember. And my goal is to be the best in the class. That is exactly what you have told, right? And uh, no wonder you you proved it. Good. Whatever challenges were given to you, you actually have uh, taken those challenges. You have accomplished those. And I still remember the egg project. While a lot of people were struggling to crack it, you cracked it, right? You cracked it. And probably that, that was the reason why you were selected for an award as well, right? So it, it has been an incredible journey, I should say, moment, right? Mm, throughout. Yes. Yeah, I, I I would probably miss your Halim, right? But uh, um, yeah, it, it, it has been an incredible journey, no doubt about that. So we want to hear from you, moment. How was your journey in 360 Digit MG? And how was your journey in InnoDataTics? Can you throw some light on that? Yeah, sure. Uh, first of all, uh, thank you so much, Bernie, to you and uh, the entire 360-digit MG family for giving me this wonderful opportunity to represent myself on this platform. And of course, a big thank to you for your support and guidance for uh, whatever I have achieved in my career. Uh, I come from the non-IT background. Uh, I completed my B.Tech in Mechanical Engineering in uh, 2016. And uh, post that, I have decided to switch my career into the field of data science and AI, artificial intelligence. Uh, I did a lot of research that where should I join, be it Bangalore or Hyderabad, because I never uh, uh, expose any of these cities. Uh, so I come through your LinkedIn profile. I went through your demo sessions and it was uh, overwhelming for me. It was really motivated for me. And I thought that I will be taking training from only 360-digit MG. I joined the training over there and uh, <clears throat> you and Sharath was there to guide us. And the day when I completed my training, it was like, yes, it's it's a cup of my tea. That uh, I covered end to end because the uh, course curriculum, which has been designed in such a way in 360-digit uh, MG, it is like you are covering each and everything, be it from Python, SQL, uh, your Power BI or machine learning concepts. End to end, we are getting the uh, knowledge of these data science and uh, artificial intelligence skills. So it was really, really good experience. Bernie. Wonderful, wonderful. And what about your experience uh, on the projects that you have worked on moment? And even before that, if people are wondering, why am I doing this success story? Let me tell you that. Uh, Momen is now working as a data scientist in Volvo. And uh, Volvo is also one of our customers. So the moment uh, you told me, Momen, I was extremely happy that on one side, we are doing AI projects and another side, you nailed it, right? You got into Volvo. I um, mean, I was very happy and that too in your hometown. A lot of people keep asking me on tier two, tier three, do we have openings and all that. AI is everywhere. Right. This is just the beginning and I'm sure you would refer a lot of us, you know, students, a lot of people who are currently working with us and then they will also affirmatively work alongside you. So how was your experience working on the projects moment? Yeah, but really, I would say that the project on which I have worked, be it uh, from the poultry mm -hmm. industry or be it from the retail, uh, the one thing what I get the advantage is because uh, since I worked on Kafka and uh, the thing is that my client uh, where I, I was interviewed in Volvo Aisha, they were also uh, working, uh, expecting the same experience from the person who worked on Kafka. So, of course, it was a advantage for me. It put some extra weightage on my resume. And uh, of course, after the training, uh, your uh, theoretical concepts along with that practical knowledge is very, very important. And I, th I think uh, 360-digit MG is the place where you are getting both.
practical as well as uh, sorry theoretical as well as practical concept so the experience was it like it was amazing and i'm really happy that uh, because of that only i'm uh, i have reached to this position wonderful so yeah i i completely uh, acknowledge you proactively were going to the client location i still remember for the exploit yeah. you proactively were pushing us to go and get the solution tested because you were so excited that you cracked it and you wanted to prove it right that that's a kind of spirit which is needed uh, by everyone right and uh, finally to conclude momen what will be the single most important suggestion that you want to give to all the aspirants all of our uh, students who are currently undergoing training people who already got trained and uh, looking out for jobs and for those folks who are currently working with us right yeah w- what would be your yeah thought? yeah one thing uh, i would uh, suggest to the new participants who are joining our institute and uh, that will be out to anyone that will be that i think they should be more focused on the to build their uh, strong fundamentals in statistics and programming that is very very important and along with this in our institute i have observed that we are getting the real world hands on project exposure as well and that is a complete package we are providing to the students so it's really really helpful to get into the job and uh, to land a successful job as well in our career absolutely and your project also got published on international journal right women uh, it was in process bani ha ah, okay hopefully it will very soon get published and you'll have another feather in your cap yeah sure thank you women so thank you so much for your time all the best i could not meet you on the last day i thought that was not your last day i thought the next day you would come right so i was of that opinion otherwise yeah, yeah. i would have personally met you next day uh, i mean m- morning you had your flight so i could not meet you Sorry. yeah that time i was having a flight so yeah, yeah. next time if you are in hyderabad do let me know we'll catch up or if i am there sure. in indore i'll certainly buzz you and we can catch up yeah thank you so much yeah, moment and uh, given your qualities hard working dedication you know given those kind of qualities i'm certain you will grow in leaps and bounds right you have that killer instinct that is what i've seen so no doubt you'll flourish in your career all the best and thank you so much thank you thank you so much bhani for your guidance and support thank you so much